Hello and welcome to Sizabantu. Today I'm going to create a tutorial on how to solve a problem if you are trying to download your PLC and you have a fault of network protection. Okay, this is our main function block, Lara Logic, which I've created from the previous videos. So now we're going to open. Our CPU, this is our CPU. I also have a manual PLC which is matching my CPU model. So everything has been checked and it's connected via Ethernet. So now we go to download. Everything's loading, but now there's a problem. The first thing when you have a force like this is to expand your error and see what is it saying there. It will it usually give you all the details that you need to solve the problem. If you can solve it, you can also use uh, your information window. As there you can see password uh, confidential so you just go to your CPU then you go to properties then you go down to your password as you can see it says no access so you just go to full access no protection so you don't need the password and also here you just untick protection and confidentiality if this doesn't work, there's also another option. Just go to your, your main software uh, page and then you go to properties and then you go to protection because usually this is just a problem and then you untick and then you say okay. And then now you combine your project As you can see down there, there are no errors. You must check for errors there. Everything looks fine. There are no warnings. There are no errors, just, just one warning about the function block. I think this is concerning my PLC type. Then uh, this, this is the first way, this is the other way you can use to download, but to explain or do more of this on the other videos because they are all different for now just choose that hardware configuration and downloading which is the same as clicking the download from the top but here you are downloading everything to your PLC not only your project or program so here you can choose if you want to stop your PLC. Uh, I always like to stop my module so that you don't cause any harm to your PLC, hardware PLC. Then you, you load your project. Uh, this takes just a few minutes. Then you can also choose there if you want to start your module after you finish it on your action. So you just start same as the run. As you can see, we have finished now downloading our PLC. We have solved the error. We have downloaded our program. So now we can just monitor our project. And there is our project. It's online now. As you can see, everything seems to be fine. So you can just press that at the top to go offline. This problem usually happens with version 16 TIE portal and upward. So this is how we just solve it to download your project. The quiz for today is why do you need the password protection on your PLC? Thank you. See you in another video.